metres higher. Well, one can't help reflecting that uh, the pace still hasn't uh, picked up at all. Uh, this time when they come around, they'll have two laps to go, two and a half laps at this moment. Uh, the Steve Ovette, if he believes in himself enough, with his finishing speed, has got to have a chance of a medal if he just have the courage to get up there amongst them. Uh, because the pace suits him, without a doubt. The distance may not, but he's run a lot faster than this already, over five metres. And he has finishing speed, whether he's got the desire, and he is coming out off the curve, third from back, perhaps he'll make a move. Two laps to go. And Googie leads, a wheat a second, Ignatiev third. Fourth place, Deleuze of Switzerland, showing for the first time. Fifth is Jack Buchter, who has made no bid at all uh, to increase the pace. Usually enjoys the same pace. Then the Castro twins. Russo is there. Amara of Ireland. Uh, Tim Hutchins has moved up to join them. And uh, Steve Ovett just out of touch with the leading group. Just following Sydney Marie and losing a bit of ground. Well, there's so many possibilities here now with 600 metres to go. A Wheater with a 144 half mile, 800 metres behind him. Uh, well, he should be one of the first finishers, but who knows, because the pace has been so slow. One of the Castro's coming wide. And this time they're coming round to the bell. And Awita hits the front. Awita leads and Buckner's back in fifth place. Awita leads, Delis in second place. Uh, Castro is third. That's Domingos Castro, one of the twins. Bukta finding a pace hard to live with. Russo in fifth place. Ignati of six. Tim Hutchins improving in eighth. Hope it's left now. Not been, not been able to get in touch with the leaders. So we're just over 200 to go. The world record holder, Awita, leads. Castro, Domingos Castro in second place. Third is Deleuze. And Castro can't get to Awita. He's not coming away too smoothly. But Awita is going to win uh, the world title. Castro in second place, Deleuze is third, Bukta four, Russo five. Moroccan sprinting away. The rest just can't get to him. And Awita wins in second place, Castro. And Bukta comes through late for third place against the bronze. Deleuze, Russo five. Nadia, Tim Hutchins in sixth place. And Hutchins back, and sorry, and uh, Ovet way back, about uh, fourth or fifth from the back. The time, 13.26.46. A week's last lap, 53 seconds. He didn't make it look easy, but it was good enough. Uh, Jack Buchner in third place came through very, very late indeed. Not his sort of race. Perhaps a little surprised he didn't gamble and go for gold with a sustained run. But he's got a bronze medal now in the World Championship to go with his European goal. Steve Avet, one felt with a slower pace that uh, if he'd had the confidence to get up, or perhaps he just couldn't make it, let's uh, be frank about that. If he could have got to the leaders in a fast finishing race like that, but he, he does sweat up an awful lot, Brendan, doesn't he? He say, he's, he's gesturing, saying it was too hot, but I mean, it's not, not one of the hottest days we've had here, but the race was slow, and he says he couldn't run any fast past He's saying, I couldn't run any fast it was too hot. And Awida, you know, they played his game, he didn't care, he finished with a 53-second last lap, but there wasn't anybody in the race who tried to beat him, and that left me feeling a little bit cold about the race. We've seen some great races here, and we were all expecting a great 5,000 metres. Maybe we anticipated too much. Maybe running against the Wheater is just too intimidating a prospect. Well, that certainly seemed to be the case, and yet having said that, that was no way to try and beat him, and there was no one in the field, 15 runners, um, 14 of them, didn't appear to be running for gold. Well, I've just seen a banner in the stadium with red and green and it said Rambo, and I think uh, maybe that's how they think about him right now. But Jack Buckner, the race didn't go his way, but he came through late to get a bronze medal. There, Awida away and cruising there. Castro in second place and Deleuze, Deleuze in third place, and Jack Buckner out of it there. Jack's been working hard on uh, acclimatization. He's been living in a sweat box up in Loughborough, 
you know, heating it up and sitting in there and doing crosswords and getting acclimatized. Seems to have worked because Jack came rushing through. Awida comfortably the winner. Castro in second place, and that's a good run for Castro. We weren't expecting him as one of the faster finishers. And just on the line, Jack gets through and beats Deleuze. And Jack's just proving it, what a world-class athlete he is. The race wasn't his type of race, and he still came through and got a bronze medal. And that's an excellent performance. It is indeed. And uh, the last we saw Jack Butner, because the camera closed on the winner here, uh, Awita, he looked to be in an impossible position to take the bronze. Uh, but he came through very, very quickly in the closing stages, something that uh, he's not reputed to be able to do, but uh, certainly managed it there. Sorry, Awita, 26. World record holder at 1,500, at 2,000 and 5,000 metres, the Olympic champion at 5,000 metres, and now the world champion.